with you. Two of them?
They're dead. And you must be Midon. He doesn't speak. So I've heard. I'm here to find out why. Chrysis did this to him. Uh -huh. I thought he did this to himself. To prove his loyalty to her. Now, why would Chrysis want an elder priest to cut out his tongue? Midon is a caring, generous man. I want answers from him. Not you. Tell me about the Spartan woman and her baby. He can only answer yes or no. The Spartan woman. Was her name Rini? They said she had a baby with her. Was it hers? The baby was close to death when they arrived. Midon prayed for its life. You saved the child. No? He did everything he could, but the baby was badly wounded. 
Did she tell you where she was going? Do all sanctuary priests take their servants to bed? I'm not his servant. We share a sacred bond. Sacred? <laughs> right. I know why Chrysis made you cut out your tongue. The night my mother brought my sister here, you and your priests left her for dead. And Chrysis didn't like you telling the story. That's not what happened! What do you know? You're too young to have been there. He told me the story many times before that witch stole his voice. He tried to save the baby, did everything he could. I don't believe you. Dead. How can my baby be dead? I don't know what to tell you. You were lucky she survived as long as she did. That, that fall was devastating. <laughs> my baby. My baby. <laughs> Listen, there's nothing we can do for you anymore. You'd best be on your way. Ray is here. Right? <laughs> They're gone. They're both gone. He wept for that Spartan woman, so far from home. Her baby barely recognizable, hardly breathing. Tell me, please. I need to know. Not even Apollo could save the child. Midon told me how the Spartan woman wept, held the baby in her arms, sang to her, before finally leading her to the gods. Chrysis took the baby, didn't she? And she made you cut out your tongue to hide the truth. Where is Chrysis? There is an altar where people offer their sick babies to be healed. This is where she took the child. Find it near the statue of Apollo Maleatas, and you'll find Chrysis. People come to this sanctuary to heal. But I come here and find people dying without hope. Priests without tongues and babies. Left with an insane woman! <laughs> My mother was a fool to trust any of you. I'm going to find Chrysis, and she's going to pay for what she's done. Hush, my child. May Ira bless our sacred family. This is the key to... Mother, I must find this altar of Apollo Maliatas. Yeah! <laughs> 
There's the altar of Apollo Maliatas. There's the statue of Apollo, and a warning. Must be getting close. All you cultists will die here! Off we go now. Hey, hey, hey. 
Come on. All you cultists will die here! Yeah, I'm trying to kick her off the inside of her. That's pushing me out that I can't help the baby. Yeah, pushing me up. Yeah, will die here! She didn't fall like I wanted her to. You have to eat his own life. Ah. I saw a booty and get her to nothing. I missed my first couple. <laughs> Come on. Get her. Let's go. All you cultists will die here.
build this. Oh, so we get it. seems to run in your bloodline, almighty oh eagle bearer. Don't you dare speak of my family, snake! I still remember the night your mother brought me my child. The sad, pathetic thing, crying in the rain. Had I known then that Mirini had two children. But here you are. My family is complete. You let my mother believe her baby was dead. But she was. Oh, how your mother wept when that little heart stopped beating. But then I took care of her, placed her on this very altar, screamed for the gods to spare her life, and they listened. What did you do with my sister? I saved her life by teaching her to suffer, to know pain so well that she would learn to welcome it like an old friend. And now she will teach all of the Greek world to know that pain. You... tortured? I taught her to survive. This world is cruel. It demands strength or death. So I gave her strength. I'll run my spear through your throat for the pain you've caused. Your mother was a weakling who whined to the gods like a pig on an altar. I am more a mother to her child than she will ever be. I can be a mother to you too, Eagle Bearer. This goes beyond my family. You and your cult are going to destroy the Greek world. You bring nothing but suffering. You talk of suffering, and yet you come drenched in blood and threaten my life. You are a killer, just like your sister. Here, let me show you. My child! This baby is yours? He was dying. Chrysis had me bring a gift to Ira so that he might be protected. Chrysis lit the temple on fire with the boy and me inside. Chrysis is a servant of Ira. She does what needs to be done. What needs to be done? She left your baby to burn alive. And you saved him. Gods bless you, Eagle Bearer. Sleep now, sweet child. Mater is here. I'm not sure saving that baby was the right thing to do. Chrysis' reign of terror must end. If what Chrysis said was true, Mirini believes my sister died long ago. I had to dress it all over again, bro. That's dumb as fuck. Like, no, boy, that's dumb as fuck. Fuck, man. It pissed me off. All you cultists will die here! Yeah. <laughs> 
he died. The question and everything, now that was stupid. That was kind of funny. Now I gotta do it all over again. Let's go. All you cultists will die here! Tell us how you have you just try to kill me then. <coughs> Killing Don't you I still remember you but she was Where that weakling crawled to the hills of Corinth. The monger was supposed to deliver her back to me, but she can't hide forever. She will give your mother this goes you talk <laughs> my this is crisis crisis what needs to be and you sex sleep now i'm not sure saving that baby was the right thing to Chris's reign of terror must end. If what Chris said was true, he really believes my sister died long ago. I can't let Chris walk free. I'll kill that Malak.
mistake. I should be careful. I security here. No, I just don't have an auto. I knew that was gonna happen. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Every time I fuck with the lions. This area will be well defended. Ah! <laughs> 
Quit having all them goddamn people look at me, nigga. Leave me the fuck alone. And I'm letting them just go. She kinda like far, I don't even know why. Hey, 
they do come out of their hands at tomorrow. Gibiadi said the Atera here could help me find my mother. I should look around for Anthusa's whereabouts. Are you Anthusa? Me? Anthusa? I could be anyone for you, Lam. I'd search less than the Atera. But do I ever know my way around the hay bed? So her name means something to you? Anthusa? She's been around forever, but I never met her. I know the Etera all work as one, on equal footing, but Anthusa's special. She talks, they listen. If the Hetera aren't here, where are they? Their swords are too high and mighty to be down here in the dirt with us. You want them, you'll find them upon the hill. The Acrocorin. By the temple, keeping Aphrodite's worshippers satisfied. No pay, no play. If you want your precious Etera, go to the temple of Aphrodite. Corinth. Corinth. Corinth, the city Corinth. of pots, prostitutes, of pots, prostitutes. and not much, else. not much else. Temple on top of the Acrocorid. That's what I'm looking for. <coughs> I don't want to be spotted here. Yeah. <laughs> 
Hello. I think they are. I need to stop them. Yes, something to hurt. is dedicated to them, the brutes. Uh, the thieves are here, and the Hetera aren't. The Hetera? <laughs> They're much wiser than we are. They realize their visitors were all getting robbed on the way in. There's no avoiding the mongers' men in Corinth. I'll keep my guard up. He craves money, Mistios. Not only that, but power. Once he smells it on you, you're a gunner. So the monger is a Corinthian criminal? Master of the underground markets. He rules... A drachmi and blood-hungry monster. If you know of the Hetera, then you know of Anthusa. I'm looking for her. They say she's... everywhere. Though I've never seen her. But the Hetera see everything. I've seen them gather by the spring of Pireni, down the mountain. They meet clients there, and then take them elsewhere in secret. Good. Maybe pray to Aphrodite from home next time. This looks like the place. General was also a poet. It's 
shouldn't... Ah, so Alexios has finally found us. You know me. And you know her. This is Anthusa. We saw you help the worshippers at the temple of Aphrodite. You've proven yourself a friend. Hear that, Icaros? Her sight's as good as yours. Someone also spoke very highly of you. Surprise! Phoebe! Aspasia sent me. I work for her now, remember? But why here? Corinth isn't safe. I had the talent to say you were coming. Aspasia taught me a new word. Emissari. That's me. And now Alexios and I have met. See? This is easy. And now I can help you. I guess that'll be all right. Who knows what I'll get into. Yes! Just make sure you're extra careful. We need to move inside, Alexios. We're not the only ones watching. Come with me, and we'll talk. Can I come? As long as you're quiet. To what do I owe your visit? Tibiadis told me about you. <laughs> Did he? Go on. I'm looking for a woman from Sparta. A runaway, long ago. She may have gone by the name of Mirini. Who's that? She's my mother. Your mother? You don't have a mother. Marcos told me he raised you. What did I tell you about talking? I see. There will be time to respond to your question, but that time isn't now. As long as you tell me what you know, sooner or later. You'll have to trust me. You don't get to where I stand without credibility. My word is yours. And you can always trust Alexios. Why don't you go play, Phoebe? Let me and Anthusa talk. If you say so... I propose a trade. Help me. Help us get stronger. Strong enough to rid Corinth of the monger permanently. A simple transaction, I assure you. You have a deal. A wise decision, dear Mystios. I haven't made it this far being a fool. Then we're in business now. I heard about him after I killed his men. Seems he's famous in court. For all the wrong reasons. His knife has shed much Corinthian blood. Then you've held your ground well. Not yet, anyway. But he's employed. He's been killing the her. Killing? We're smarter. I'm not the only one who needs help. My girls. More monger trouble. I wouldn't doubt it. Work against the... I'll see what I can do. Good. The monger... So, if someone interrupts... Exactly. Then the warehouse will be cindered.
got no use for you here. There will be trouble if I'm spotted here. Dios.
There's resolve in you. We have that in common. I saw innocents trapped in the flames. The ones in the warehouse? I freed them already. A good soldier acts when he's told. A great one is two steps ahead. Thank you. My name's Alexios. I'd thank you too if I knew who you were. Brazidas of Sparta. You're a newcomer to Corinth. You're a spy too. An old Spartan tactic. I have my ways. I get the sense that's a Corinthian hobby. Anthusa has her Atera watching from every post. Ah, Anthusa. We disagree, but have a common enemy. The monger. We agree he should be killed, but we differ on how. What do you want to do with him? Right now, the monger rules Corinth. I want to replace him with minimal bloodshed. Killing him and his men doesn't seem to fit your peaceful proposal. Nothing else has been successful. Trust me. What happened? We arrested his top men, armed the citizens, tried to stir the police against him. It never came to be. The only thing left to try is a quick slice of the blade. That would do it. We'd lure him into Corinthia's sacred cave, and it'd be over. By the time I leave Corinthia, the monger will be dead. Do that, and Sparta will be in your debt. I was Spartan once. Once? Until I was thrown off Mount Taigetos as a child and left for dead. You're the son of General Nicolaus? All of Sparta knows your name! And here you are, alive! Impossible! survived. I raised myself alone while life continued in Sparta. Never mind being a Spartan. Those of good character will forgive and should be forgiven. <sighs> I'm on the hunt for my mother, Merini. And the only way is through Anthusa. Yes, Merini. You don't know anything about Merini, do you? I know that no one should have to endure such tragedy alone. And I heard she left Sparta that night. No one has forgotten Marini. From what I know, she wanted them to forget. You knew Nicolaus. A good general, but a stubborn Spartan. And rewarded for his loyalty. But he disappeared, and his body was never found. The state pronounced him dead. That's all right. I haven't seen him since I was a child. There's no going back now. 
The displaced can always find their way home. The gods have just decided you must fight for it. Uh, they couldn't make it any easier. Chin up, Spartan. Easy doesn't exist. Goodbye, Brasidas. We'll meet again. I'm in the fight with you. Show courage. Yeah, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, tap in with the K. We'll be back with some more videos. Y'all know what's going on, Dick, and I'm surprised y'all my abilities. I guess you will do nothing. I ain't gonna do it. Let's get it.